Elijah will come restore all things. An interpretation of the books of Malachi, Matthew and Revelation of the Holy Bible. In the mid-5th century BCE, the Hebrew prophet Malachi wrote a promise from Yahweh. Behold, I will send you Elijah the prophet before the great and awesome day of the Lord comes. Four centuries earlier, Yahweh had taken the prophet Elijah alive into heaven. Nearly 500 years later, Jesus took with him Peter and James and John his brother and led them up a high mountain by themselves. And he was transfigured before them and his face shone like the sun and his clothes became white as light. And behold, there appeared to them Moses and Elijah, talking with him. Afterwards, Jesus commanded these men, Tell no one the vision, until the Son of Man is raised from the dead. And the disciples asked him, Then why do the scribes say that first Elijah must come? He answered, Elijah does come and he will restore all things. According to the book of Revelation, chapter 11, Elijah is to exercise authority from the temple of God in Jerusalem for 1260 days. The book of Malachi reveals seven things that Elijah is to restore, as he prepares again the way for Yahweh's coming to his restored temple. One, true instruction from Yahweh's covenant with Levi, turning many from iniquity. Two. True marriage, men remaining faithful to their first wife, seeking to rear godly children. 3. Purify the sons of Levi who will bring righteous offerings to your way, as in the days of old. 4. Bring tithes into the storehouse the house of your way. 5. Make a clear distinction between those who serve God and those who do not. 6. Teach the law of Moses, with its statutes and rules commanded of all Israel. 7. Turn the hearts of parents to their children, and of children to their parents. 8. Thus, Elijah will raise up and send out no fewer than 144,000 Israelites as evangelists to the Gentiles, before the end times beast makes war on them, slays them, and they appear with Jesus the Lamb of God upon Mount Zion in heaven. Then, the Lord Jesus will return suddenly from heaven to Jerusalem, a swift witness against all forms of wickedness. Repent and be baptized every one of you in the name of Jesus Christ for the forgiveness of your sins, and you will receive the gift of the Holy Spirit. Save yourselves from this crooked generation.